Eddie's Service by Rudyard Kipling Read in English, this is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information, or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Eddie, priest of St. Wilfred, in the chapel at manhood end, ordered a midnight service for such as cared to attend. But the Saxons were keeping Christmas, and the night was stormy as well. Nobody came to service, though Eddie rang the bell. Wicked weather for walking, said Eddie of manhood end, but I must go on with the service for such as care to attend. The altar candles were lighted. An old marsh donkey came, bold as a guest invited, and stared at the guttering flame. The storm beat on at the windows, the water splashed on the floor, and a wet, yoke-weary bullock pushed in through the open door. How do I know what is greatest? How do I know what is least? That is my father's business, said Eddie, Wilfred's priest. But three are gathered together. Listen to me and attend. I bring good news, my brethren, said Eddie of manhood end. And he told the ox of a manger and a stall in Bethlehem. And he spoke to the ass of a rider that rode to Jerusalem. They steamed and dripped in the chancel, they listened and never stirred, while just as though they were bishops, Eddie preached them the word, till the gale blew off on the marshes, and the windows showed the day, and the ox and the ass together wheeled and clattered away. And when the Saxons mocked him, said Eddie of manhood end, I dare not shut his chapel on such as care to attend. End of Eddie's Service by Rudyard Kipling Read by Noel Badrian